Hey cuties! So today I'm going to be doing an April favorites video. Do you guys love my hair? This is a day old, so it kind of looks a little fuzzy right now, but we're just not even gonna look at it. It's super cute, I love it. If you guys follow my vlog channel, then you would have seen me get this installed. And it's so cute! There's like a mermaid hair, there's like yellow, black, blue, everything, everything. So I haven't done a favorite video in probably a year. It's been a minute. So I thought I would come and bring back Old Pink Sparkles and do a favorite video of stuff that I've been loving. I've been loving actually a lot of products in this month. That's why this sparked it. You guys should subscribe because I love you guys so much. Oh, my clavicle's popping. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> So the very first thing that I've been loving is this. This is Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula. It looks so boring, but honestly, this has taken away all my stretch marks on my sides. So a couple, actually probably like six months ago, I noticed that I was getting like purple, thick, like almost like tiger scratch stretch marks on my hips. That's where I noticed it a little bit on my butt, but mainly all over my hips. And when I saw it, I got a little discouraged and I was sad about it, but people get stretch marks, women get stretch marks, men, like men get, everyone gets stretch marks or can get stretch marks. It's either going too big or too small, losing weight, gaining weight, your elasticity in your skin, lots of things cause stretch marks. So it's definitely not something to feel ashamed of. From somebody who like was ashamed of it, like even though I love my body, I, I don't know why, I just like had this feeling like, hmm, like cool, summer's coming up and I was just like sad about it and I just decided to do something about it and embrace them at the same time. So that's what I did. And I was like, you know what? They're they're cute. I love them. They're me. So basically we're researching a lot about stretch marks and it pretty much your skin. Like if your skin doesn't have a lot of moisture in it, if you're not lotioning your body when you get out of the shower and regularly, then your skin loses that moisture and it breaks pretty much. It separates. So this, um, I used bio oil as well. That helped. But as soon as I started using this, they're like gone. They're like very, very faint now. They're almost like white before they're they were like thick and purple and like you could just like notice them from across the room and I was like hmm I grew to accept them because they're beautiful and if you have stretch mark scars cellulite whatever you have it's beautiful and you just have to fully embrace it within yourself because I can tell you all day long your stretch marks are beautiful but it depends on you you gotta love them this is what I used to get rid of them it's super oily it like ruined clothes I had mm, I really like the smell of it. it's like sunner sunner summer suntan lotion love that and you guys see like I didn't even use a lot of this because it works like a little bit like I would do like half a squirt both my sides and I just rubbed it in. Okay, next what I've been loving is this. If you guys watch my cheapest, I buy the cheapest thing on Moschino. Um, this is what I got on there. So spoiler alert if you haven't seen it. And it's a body wash. It's the Fresh Couture by Moschino Pink. So good. I'm literally like washing myself in couture every day. And I honestly, I have like this much left. I'm pro. It's so expensive to buy this like as a regular body lotion on it or shower gel, but it is so good. I smell like, I still smell fresh from this. It's amazing. And my bathroom just smells like fresh and clean. I love the packaging. I love it so much. By the way, if anyone's gonna tell you that your stretch marks or anything on you is ugly, it's not happening for you. It's not happening for you, girl, because that's, no, I'll tell you right now. I've been getting so many questions on this. So that's why this is in here and I love it so much. So this is the Fenty Beauty, I think it's called the Gloss Balm. Gloss Balm in Fussy. And there's two dollar signs for the S's. I love that's my aesthetic. And this is all I'm wearing on my lips today. I'm not wearing any lip liner, lipstick, anything. Just this. And on all my snaps, people screenshot them and message me on Twitter and they're like, what lip color is this? I get this so much. Even on my Instagram pictures, I'm like, it's literally just this Fenty Beauty gloss balm. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I'm not trying to like mm, anything, but a lot of Fenty Beauty products, have, not all of them, but a lot of them I've tried, I'm just like, meh. Like they're, they're good, but they're not like amazing to me where I'm gonna repurchase. I don't know if they have more shades of this, but I would buy, I'm gonna buy them all. Like this is so good. It's glossy, but it's not sticky. It feels like almost like lip chap on your lips lips and it just like makes your lips pop. I've been looking for a good gloss for so long that's like super glossy and like that 90s like brass doll look and this is it my friend. I love it. Just to give you guys an idea, my lips are not like this. Like <laughs> this literally makes them so super good. When I get more injections, this is going to be like pow. Okay, what oh my god, no. This one I think is like my favorite beauty product right now in general for the past two months now. This is the one I first got. So I went to Sally's and I got some lashes. And I was like, I should just grab some lash glue anyway. I was going on a trip with Dalton at this time. This was about two months ago. So I just grabbed the lashes and um, the duo lash glue because everyone loves the duo lash glue. It's like the best lash glue. So I grab it. And then the next day when I'm getting ready, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna use my lashes. I realized 
realize that I got the wrong duo when I'm like, I'm not even gonna use that. When you love something, you stick to, well, at least I do, girl. That's why I don't do a lot of favorites videos because I literally like love the same shit. But this is duo, it just wasn't the same. So basically it's called the Quick Set Strip Lash Adhesive. So it is a brush on adhesive rather than the squeeze tube. Actually, it's not really brush on, it's kind of like a spatula, I guess. I realized that was the only lash glue I had and I had spent money on it, so why not give it a shot? And it says, dries in five seconds. We love a good claim. <laughs> when I'm using the duo, I have like, I'm going like this like forever. Like it's still tacky, it's still tacky, it's still tacky. I put it on and by the time I got my tweezers, like so I basically don't wait because five seconds. So I just put it on like this and make sure to coat both the ends because I feel like they lift. Take the tweezers and then stick it right on and it sticked immediately. So there's no, there's no going like this. There's no waiting and putting your lashes down. It's literally immediate and it's so easy to apply. You don't like squirt out a whole bunch because it's just like a spatula. This is life changing to me. I wish this was sponsored honestly because it seems like I'm like buy this product. So amazing that I bought the white one because I don't know why. I just wanted to try it. That's what I'm wearing right now is the white one. This applies so well that I can just literally stick my lash on it's stuck. So I picked up this finally. So many people have been raving about this for years and years. This is the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind um, Dark Circle Eraser and I've heard people talk about this for years and I was just at Walmart so I'm like I'm gonna get it and this is how much I've used of it already. This is such good concealer. I know you guys are probably like, we know. Like, we already know. Like, where have you been, girl? But like I said, when I love something, I stick to it. If you're the one person like me that didn't know, this is such good stuff. I love the consistency. It's nice and smooth. It blends so well, and it does reduce my dark circles. And it looks really, really nice throughout the day, and it sets nicely. So I love that. Okay, next, I got some lotion from Bath & Body Works. Now, I have so many perfumes and lotions, but I realized that I have so many that I'm not able to use them all. So all of them are expired because I have so many it's like impossible to use all these perfumes and all these lotions So basically what I did is I gave away and threw away like pretty much I had to throw away because they were all rancid Like they're all like they smelled like I purchased two at Bath & Body Works So that's all I have and this one is just so good from Bath & Body Works It's 24 hour moisture ultra shea body cream. This one's called magic in the air it kind of has a little shimmer to it I feel oh my god. What does it smell like it smells like seduction perfume from Victoria's Secret. I don't know. I don't know how else to explain it. It just smells like like a princess. It's not like fruity. It's more like like picture how Kim Kardashian would smell. Fit. This Ariana Grande Cloud perfume is so yummy to me. I did a video um, trying the Ariana Grande Cloud uh, Macchiato, and in that video I bought this, and I've used this much since that video, and it's so good. This packaging. It smells so weird. It smells like skunk slash weed. Sla I don't even know. It's just this, this does not smell good. But <laughs> that's why I don't usually take this out of here. I just spray it like this. It just smells like pure candy. And I get a lot of compliments on it. Probably because I like douse myself in it, to be honest with you. Next, I have a Jeffree Star um, Velour Lip Scrub. This is Rainbow Sherbert. And I think this was from his um, like Thirsty collection or whatever. I don't know. I'm sorry. Sorry to all the Jeffree Star fans out there. I don't remember. But I just found this. Like I need a lip scrub. I don't even have a lip scrub and I'm like, oh my god, what about the lip scrub I bought? So I was like digging and digging and I finally found it and I've been using it, oh my god, ever since I found it, which was about two weeks ago and it smells so good. I'd never used Jeffree Star lip scrub before and honestly, so amazing. The crystals are just so fine, but get all the dead skin away from your lips. I really enjoy this. I also like the size of it, the smell, and it works. The fact that it works, it makes my skin, like my lips are kissably smooth. <laughs> Along the same lines, um, I've been loving this Jeffree Star Frozen Peach Supreme Frost highlighter. I'm wearing it right now on my cheekbones and down my nose and a little bit on my clavicles. That's probably why I was like, ooh, my clavicles popping. <laughs> this highlight is so good to me. A little goes a long way and it's so vibrant. It's not like chunky or super noticeable on your face or you're gonna be like, that's fake. So I might be a little d dumb on this and that's okay if I am. So this, I have always used the Laura Mercier translucent powder, setting powder, but I feel like this one's different. I don't know if they changed their formula recently or if it's just a bigger package. So maybe I'm able to get my beauty blender in there better and set my under eyes or if they changed or if I got a different one, I'm sorry. So this is the translucent loose setting powder in 
translucent. It just sets my under eyes so beautifully. Like, I don't think I could do my makeup without this. Like, it just, it completely sets everything and makes everything so amazing. I've, so I've been not only setting my under eyes, but setting like my forehead and my nose and my chin and my smile line pretty much everywhere. So good, it just makes your makeup flawless. You guys probably all know about this. Like, everyone uses it and for good reason. Oh no, I got it all over my leg. Love that for me. Okay, the very last thing that I have been loving is this. So basically, I wanted a probiotic gummy and I, I don't take like vitamins or pills. I take Advil very rarely. So if I have like a really bad headache and if I, so if I have a really bad headache, usually I'll just like lay down in my house or just chill or try to go to sleep or take a nap or something like that. But if I have to go somewhere, like if I'm going out for supper or you know, I have plans with someone, I'm like, okay, I have to take an Advil. So I take, probably a full Advil, maybe two a year, <laughs> maybe three a year, if that, because I do only take a half at a time. So I don't really take anything else in my body. But I was like, you know what? I've heard lots of stuff about a probiotic and it's, you know, I'm getting old. So I have to start thinking of medication. I'm gonna be that granny, like counting all my vitamin D. I have trouble swallowing pills and these are gummies. They taste really yummy and it's just good for your gut health. What does it do? Let's really read. Very blessed. It supports the maintenance of digestive health. I don't know, I'm not a nutritionist, I'm not a doctor. Don't be like, oh, Pink Sparkle's got a probiotic, so I'm gonna go get one. No, if like, go get the lash glue if you wanna, you know, do something that I did. <laughs> Taking a bunch of probiotics and then all of a sudden growing like sticks out their legs or naps and then they're like, cool, Pink Sparkle's told me to take this. <laughs> Just consult with your doctor, nutritionist, pharmacist, even like at Walmart, there's a pharmacist, at least where I am. So just say like, hey, what does this do? These are the medications I'm taking. Is it cool for me to take this? Don't just listen to me because I don't know anything. I just decided to take it and it... I've noticed nothing. <laughs> I just feel like it's working. I just feel better. I feel better. And and as you guys have been saying you're glowing lately. I'm like, love that. Maybe it's from the probiotics. Who knows? Those were all my favorites. Um, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I hope you guys have a beautiful day. You guys are all special and you're worth it. Your stretch marks and all. I will talk to you guys all later. Bye.